Hey everyone, welcome back and in today's video we're going to be talking about dedicated static IPs, how they can help improve your privacy and the best 3 VPNs that offer such services. And without further ado, let's get started. Also, if at any point in this video you would like to check out any of these VPNs that I mentioned today, you'll find all the useful links including discounts in the description down below. For starters, what are dedicated and static IPs and how beneficial can they be? Well, most VPNs have servers around the globe with something called a dynamic IP, which is always changing. And so if you want to disconnect and reconnect from a VPN server, you'll end up with a new IP address every time. Servers with static IPs, however, will always have have the same address no matter how many times you disconnect and reconnect. Now dedicated IPs are similar to static IPs and the only difference between the two is that you're the only one who can use this IP address. With that being said, having a static IP or dedicated IP is super useful if you want to see fewer capture prompts which you don't want to keep going through every time you connect to a VPN because you're accessing it from a different IP address. Also, having one of the two minimizes the risk of your financial accounts being suspended due to suspicious activity. And that's because banks or other financial platforms will see that you're accessing your account from different IP addresses and will suspect that you got hacked or that there's financial fraud involved, which means that you have to call and explain to them the situation every single time. But with a dedicated IP address, you won't have to worry about stuff like this and you'll keep these financial accounts intact. Now before I give you my recommendations for some of the best VPNs out there, it's important to note that this video is meant for educational purposes only and I do not support or condone any illegal activities using these VPNs. So please make sure that your online actions are responsible and in line with your country's policies. With that being said, these three right here are going to be my top three VPNs that offer either static IPs or dedicated IPs. First up, we have NordVPN, which is overall the best here as it offers both static and dedicated IPs. Now, if you switch to OpenVPN protocol, you will be able to get the static IP specialty servers right here. And the cool thing about these is that you don't have to pay for any of them as they're included in your subscription. And when it comes to dedicated IP addresses, you can also get one from NordVPN as an add-on for a little bit extra. Now, to give an example for static IPs, if you look at the specialty servers right here, number 4981, it has its own static IP address. And no matter how many times I disconnect or reconnect it, I'll still have the same IP. IP address. Moving on to Surfshark, you can't really purchase your own dedicated IP address like you would with NordVPN. However, you can still get a static IP service similar to NordVPN's free dedicated IP servers right here. And that's amazing given the fact that it's one of the most budget-friendly VPNs out there. And finally, we have CyberGhost where you don't have any free dedicated IP servers and it doesn't offer static IPs but instead you can purchase a dedicated IP address just like NordVPN. So if that's what you're looking for, you're actually going to get a really good dedicated IP address that is only for you and nobody else can use it. But of course, you're still going to have to pay a little bit extra since it's your own dedicated IP server. And that's it for today's video. Again, if you're interested in any of these VPNs, you'll find all the useful links, including discounts in the description down below. And feel free to comment below if you have any questions as I love getting to interact with you guys. Like and subscribe if you found this video to be helpful or would like to stay up to date with future videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.